welcome to Sculpture Studios. A lovely bit of Christmas decoration here, whereby Aiden's going to be doing some polystyrene carving on the turntable, and there's simply something quite satisfying about it. Hi Ruth, what are yeah. we up to here? Uh, we're making two polystyrene Christmas bells. Like this. Like that there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just blocking it out at the moment. Getting ready to cut. Should be able to get one out there and one out there. Okay, pretty really good. You set it up, give us a shout, and we'll start cutting. We'll do. Just a quick video today for a quick turnaround project, whereby the client has asked for a couple of bells to be carved and simply painted red in emulsion paints. We're cutting the polystyrene blocks down to size with the hot wire, and using polyurethane foam, the first block is then stuck onto the turntable. Now this is a very old machine that Aiden's had for well over 20 years now, and was actually first made using an old washing machine. It's amazing how the simple things often work the best. Hand tools like knives, nail and wire brushes and sandpapers, and the mechanics of a recycled kitchen appliance of all things. Aiden's first taking off the bulk of the material just to save on time, before getting the machine fired up to start carving. Looking okay. It's very bell shaped, got the hollow out the middle later on. That's the easy part, deciding on the form. The hard part now is trying to get the second one exactly like this one. And this is where um, the practice comes in. I've made a few little lines on the top and the side just to give me certain depth. And now, I'm going to have to check it by eye and then check it by feeling gauges just, or gauges just to check it up and down and keep offering one to another until I think it's nice. There I go. Now, we actually created two different sizes of these bells. The ones we originally made were about 40% smaller than the ones you've seen Aidan just carve, and when these were all painted and finished, the client came to pick them up and he thought, you know what, I'd love to go bigger with these, let's go bigger. And so here we are making two larger versions for him. The insides have now been carved out, keeping the bell still nice and thick for a bit of strength, as remember, this is still only polystyrene, but enough detail to make these a full 360 degree carving. A healthy coating of a Christmassy red, and these are now ready to go. Whether or not these were used for the first year, initially in red, and have now been repainted, we don't know, but the client has kindly sent us a few images of these being used for a second year, now repainted gold. These are sitting in prime position on the front of the building, and we'd like to thank our client Louis for approaching us with the work. We really hope your boss appreciated the sculptures, and hopefully they appreciate this video and seeing these come to life. Please feel free to leave any comments below, as they're always appreciated, and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell for our latest videos. 
You can follow us on Facebook and Instagram via the links below. And for all of our true diehard fans out there, you can now become a patron of our studio. All of our supporter contributions go toward the creation of these videos, so if you enjoy our content, you know what to do. Becoming one of our credited patrons means you'll be featured at the end of our upcoming YouTube projects like these guys here, so visit the Patreon link with this video to show your support. However big or small, it's greatly appreciated from all of us here at Sculpture Studios. Thank you very much for watching.